morning, everyone. My name is Shiza Opara, and the title of my poem is A Glimpse at Life. You reached your first milestone with that cry. Coming into this new world, oh, it really opened my eye to see such a beautiful beginning, a day that had brought so much joy, praise, and singing. Carefree, fearless, watching you grow, a sight that made me speechless. My heart was in my mouth whenever you crawled, so excited but anxious, worried that you'd fall. From your first steps to your first words, oh, how happy I was when these moments occurred. Growing up into the remarkable person you were, Losing you was a pain I could not bear. Every birthday that passed was like a precious glimpse of your image. So pure and perfect, making me remember all the memories we shared. Throughout the night, hand in hand with chilling silence, thinking so hard, what could be the essence? Milestone to milestone, we pass these stages. From age to age, some leave damages. Another day of grieving, another milestone gone. Another day without you. How do I carry on? Thank you. Good morning, everyone. My name is Dr. Saniapo. I am a representative of Avicenna School. I'm here today to recite my poem titled I Walk House. The path ran far from my sight. I set my foot for one to two miles now. I know nothing of my future steps. If I would misstep, my vision forward breaks. I push yet another roadblock and another. A routine guideline I cannot slip. Though I only wish for a taste of peace on my lips, yet I find myself closer to the start than the finish. I thought I'd missed it. I thought I overlooked the direction. But I reached a curb. I stand dead still with a blanket of joy on my head. I made it. As simple as it is, I bear sorrow no longer. I finally made it. Hi, good morning. Um, my name is Damien Dolamide Ongleme, and I'm here to recite a poem I call Milestones. Yeah. I shout and pant and yearn, effortlessly draining myself. I bustle and weave through, but you keep running away from me. Every time I get to you, it's like a milestone. Chapter and checkpoint alike. Trying to get to you is like wasting my time. I cry. Oh, yes, I cried. I tried to be better things. I even tried to forget myself, to please you. But every time I get close to you, like a milestone, chapter and checkpoints are like, trying to get to you is like wasting my time. I'm like a ghost living in my room in heaven. My heart stops and catches its breath when it sees you. Like Mount Everest, you have layers of beauty. I look like a fool when I notice your curves, lines, and your everlasting beauty. I try to talk to you, but you run away. I try to grasp you, but you run away. I try to talk to you and be with you, but you choose to disappear even the moment I set my eyes on you. That's why every time when I get to you is a milestone, chapter and checkpoint alike. Trying to get to you is like wasting my time, but I will do it again. In my name is Farouk Damale, a student of City of Knowledge Academy, and I'm here to present my poem titled The Trials. Trial one. I tried to talk about a kid I once knew who broke his knee and cried to his mother. His mother told him to remember the injury, to make the better of it in future. He then became a crippled motivational speaker. Trial three. I tried to talk about a man in the desert who felt there was no need to go on, who was just about to give up when a few drops of rain kept him going, making him 
a world record holder. Trial eight, I tried to talk about a wandering mind bound by its own imagination. It decided to pass the current to its body, converting the body into a wanderer. Now, the mind had seen what no other mind saw. Trial 15, I tried to talk about a mountain climber who dared to achieve the difficult, climbing high through the freezing cold. No man ever dared to touch his feet. Today, he is first to be the tallest. Trial 23, I start feeling hopeless. This first turn right in my face. I'm thinking I should stop trying. But I remember the story of Thomas, who tried 10,000 at one time before finally bringing light to darkness. And that's when it hit me. Trial 25. They say you should learn from your failures. Let them be the stepping stones to your success. So I took all my lost thoughts and failures, put them all in one place, just like a spark. I hit my last one. Thank you.